My name is Amy. I went to Hope College for my undergraduate degree. I attended Georgetown University. I currently work here in West Michigan with our palliative care program. People often ask me, what is the difference between palliative care and hospice care? Palliative care is an area of medicine where we are seeking to improve the symptom control. For some individuals in our program, it might just be one symptom. For others, it's a cluster of symptoms. Some of the most common symptoms that we work to improve are pain, shortness of breath, nausea, anxiety, agitation. There's a number of symptoms. Palliative care is not always a precursor to hospice care. There are individuals that we see within our palliative care program who don't have a terminal disease whatsoever. The disease that they are battling is not necessarily something that will take their life, but it is causing them physical dis discomfort or physical distress, and we're seeking to improve that. Other individuals in our palliative care program may have an illness that eventually will be terminal, um, but that's a number of years off. And so what we're striving to do is to meet the patient where they're at to allow them to have the optimal degree of functioning possible. So that may be spending time with their grandchildren, that may be engaging with hobbies, perhaps it's returning back to work and being able to function in all those areas. The visits that we have with patients in our palliative care program are structured in such a way that we allow for time for questions and concerns to be answered. Myself and my partners in the program, we are all seeking to not only provide the best advice about medications and interventions, but we're also seeking to spend time with our patients to answer questions, um, provide support, and really give as much information as possible.